Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Heroes Chronicles Warlords of the Wasteland. Today we start the last scenario of this campaign which is a medium map called Steelhorn. Tarnum has pushed the Wizard Kings all the way back to the ocean. Now he must conquer the last of their defenses including the impenetrable castle Steelhorn. Okay, we start uh, at normal difficulty, we will push it all the way to impossible and we can choose between three Thunderbirds and one Ancient Behemoth. Both of them are pretty good. I will go with the Behemoth because it will be just a little bit easier I guess. Although the Thunderbirds give you more speed, this guy gives you a bit more survivability early on. And let's begin. Offended by the brutal and bloody turn the war had taken, his captains banded together and demanded to go home. But Tarnum couldn't accept their defiance any more than he could make them continue to fight. So, at the next feast, they unwittingly drank from poisoned cups. You expected some of your soldiers to desert or rebel when they heard of the murders of Hardak and the other captains, but you experienced just the opposite. Your men love you. They especially love the victories you have been able to bring them. Now you promise that you'll finally break the back of the evil wizards. Castle Steelhorn, that which cannot be broken, will fall before us. For all eternity, the glory of what we do here will be remembered. Your grandchildren and your grandchildren's grandchildren will say your name with pride. What we do here is our immortality, assuring us all a place among the ancestors. Well, you couldn't be further from the truth, Tarnum. <laughs> That's what the rest of the Heroes Chronicles will be about, by the way. But uh, let's go with it for now. We have Tarnum, level 23 Barbarian, with some units. We do have Diplomacy, might make it a little bit easier for us. Uh, but uh, even without it, it should not be too difficult. Offense, Leadership, Tactics, Logistics, Artillery, yes. Yeah, so we don't have our Ballista. I will try to um, take that as quickly as possible. So we need a uh, blacksmith for that, so 10 wood and 2,000 gold. Okay, I think we can do that. We do not need these guys for now. One of them will be enough. I will pick up the Ordo and everything else as well and see what we can do. Do I need to go through the gremlins to the goblin barracks? I don't think so. I just go straight over here and see what happens. A lone knight leads a filthy group of peasants. Put away your swords, the knight orders you. I am the protector of these people. With your cowardly captains holding you back no longer, you see no reason not to continue. No one tells me what to do, you say, and order the attack. Yeah, nice. <laughs> uh, more peasants, okay. We can definitely do that. Uh, then probably go here. Take the money as well. This way you can build the blacksmith. Let's do that. And maybe, yeah, next turn we can probably build a or buy a ballista as well if we get our hands on some more money somewhere that is next turn then and let's continue do you see any more money anywhere inexhaustible cart of lumber is that something i want to be honest i don't think so but uh, we'll see engage these i could have actually maybe if i had my army convinced them to join me it's too late for that. I see some money over there and I can build a ballista yard already. So let's do that. Several cyclopes should not be a problem, I think. So take the 2000 gold, flag this, flag that and go for more wood, maybe more stuff over there. I'm not sure. Do we have a tavern no 
Hmm. Well, that is not cool. I would love to have access to a tavern. I guess I won't. Okay, so I do what? Go around and I can't build even a city hall here, so that's rather sad. I may need the quick uh, birds, so let's quickly do that too. There's a Cyclops cave over here. I might want that. Some more experience for us here. More experience for us there. And uh, do I go for the Cyclops cave? That's the question. I mean, it wouldn't hurt, but it's not absolutely necessary either. I mean, we can take the goblins, of course, and then maybe do this and return back. Yeah, I think that's what we will do. Your spies report that there are at least two castles and three towers between you and Castle Steelhorn. But you've caught the enemy unaware. Your horde arrived so quickly that Bracadoon hasn't been able to man them all. Now is not the time to relax, though. Attack quickly and you'll forever have an advantage over them. Yeah, that's what I thought uh, as well, but uh, I don't know. Let's take that, of course, and that's all the money that we had. So, speed 9 and speed 5, 6 and 4. I do not need anything else. These two creature uh, creatures should carry me, I think. Do I need gems? Gem pond? Maybe. Master gremlins? No. Why would I? Uh, several trolls. They also don't want to join. Okay. How about here? That's fine. Yeah, I'll pick it up and then I will go up. Okay. I, I do want to pick everything up. Just because we can. Do I need those goblins to fight anything or anybody? There is a monolith two way over there, so I guess I will not take them. Just want to go through here. It's day five. Maybe there is something nice over there. And let's do a an orc tower, maybe. Why not? And uh, what is this? A gold mine, some not so important units protecting it you find a weak looking band of miners camped at the side of the road even as your army approaches they make no move to flee they're too tired apparently these men are escaped slaves who fled bracadoon control to join the horde it amuses you when you realize they don't know who you are so you tell them to visit the rear of the column for food tell them king tarnum says so you say to them as they hike away. The men are so impressed they offer to join your forces. Really? I mean, you should have probably stayed back. Now you're gonna die. See? <laughs> Can we try to save these guys? I mean, I'm, I'm almost sorry for them. Let's see. Yeah, we can. Okay, fine. Good job there. Um, you guys can uh, protect this uh, gold mine, what do you say? Actually, these guys have speed 7, so that's almost nice. But no. <laughs> uh, money, money, whatever that is. Uh, more money. And more guys, of course. More money and we'll go there on day 7. Now, next we can do a citadel, ogre fort, things like that. Let's do a citadel. Next turn and go here. Okay, there is a conservatory there. Some more money, some more resources. I think this is a town. So it looks pretty good, I have to say. Let's start here. And yes, this is a town. So can we actually get to the town in time? I think we might be able to. 
A legion of peasants, okay. <laughs> uh, let's have a look. Nearly every peasant in the surrounding area must have gathered to stand against you and your army. A massive legion of these raggedy wizard lovers stands in your way calling you Tarnum the Murderer. Okay, so there's quite a few of them. No doubts about that. I will be probably just blinding them one by one and see what happens. So how many can we kill? All of them, fine. And you can kill half of them, so don't, don't get any stupid ideas. Just come back, do this guy, go back, do that guy, and now we can do them one by one, like this, perfect. And uh, yeah, take the town first. No losses. I didn't even check if uh, there is anybody <laughs> defending the town. Now that's important, we have a tavern. Okay, we could replenish our mana. I don't know if I want to do that or not. 140 is still much more than necessary, really. So I probably want to do a castle here to increase the growth of, of them, basically. And a marketplace wouldn't hurt, and then we'll see. So in this direction there is basically nothing. I have just some small troopers over there. This is fine. Do I want to accept them? Sure. Why not? You can stay and guard the mine for now. Excellent. You consult your seer as you do every morning. She throws the bones, stares at them for a long time and says, Assemble the broken man, the statue of Legion. With it, will come strength and glory. Okay. I think I do have two parts of it already, so that's a good start. And uh, we do want the Behemoth Lair, probably. Um, Ogre Fort, not quite yet. Although, for the Cyclops Cave, maybe. Who knows? So let's go and uh, get all these things. Uh, they are in the mood to fight. That's not good. And do I need? Yes, I actually do need a lot of this resource over here. So let's do that first. Some more peasants. Sure. Uh, let's flag that as well. We don't need to hire them though. Um, more over here. Sure. And we build something, maybe? I don't know what. I may want to go for the Portal of Glory long term, but short term I guess I will just go for money. And I could get another hero potentially. That wouldn't hurt. A bit later. So what do we have here? Endless bag of gold. We have these viverns here. Okay, glorious victory. Fine. Have we been here? Yes. You see the soldiers resting after a long march, but you approach their brandish. But as you approach, they brandish their weapons and rush into formation. You see they are transporting an artifact called the Endless Bag of Gold and you aren't about to give it up without a fight. Do you attack? And they aren't about to give it up without a fight. <laughs> yes, I do want to attack. No losses. Thank you very much. So now the question is how big is this Griffin Conservatory? And can I do it with just one ancient behemoth without a ballista? The answer is probably not, so I will need help. Okay, City Hall needs a blacksmith. Let's do that immediately. Over here we can still wait a little bit more. 
for that other hero. Who could we actually hire? Oh, hello there, Sir Mulik. And specialty estates is also not bad. But uh, we have to have Sir Mulik, right? I mean, there's no way we don't take him. Oh, hello there. <laughs> this is future Tarnum, by the way. In the next campaign, he will have this portrait. And I know that somebody told me, I forgot the name, sorry, but a very... Uh, somebody who comments a lot. Um, I know I told you I will remove these pictures, but I changed my mind. I, I think it will be a nice touch, a nice Easter egg if we see uh, Tarnum in a different attire every now and then. We won't be hiring him, no. So let's just uh, continue this way. And there, and maybe pick up all the army and, and see what happens. Okay, do we need more gems? I think we might need gems in the future. Yes, I do accept your help. You can stay in and guard the mine for me. Okay, there's more pieces of the Legion. I like. And we can build more, possibly, later. One of your scouts returns from the ocean where he had been spying on the Bracadoon Tower to the east. He tells you a story that makes you suspect this scout visits the bottle too often. I saw this great swirling hall in the water, my king, and one of the Bracadoon ships sailed right for it. I thought to myself, they are dead, when the hole swallowed them. But to my surprise, ship and the crew returned the next day, although I think there were fewer soldiers aboard than they started with. Yeah, nice introduction into whirlpools in Heroes. Thank you, game. I'll take that, thank you very much, and even flag the gremlins, why not? This is fine, I accept your help. You can stay and guard this mine. <laughs> then we have a pack of Arch Magi, sure, why not? And where does this go? A fog suddenly surrounds you. You can barely see your hand before your face, yet you ride slowly on. You're bound to come out sooner or later. But when the mist clears, you find a small army in front of you prepared to attack. And they didn't do much. Okay. There's a... town and a sawmill. Okay, I like it. Let's take this and also all the troops that we can muster. City Hall, of course, and next. So, think uh, town first. So, let's take some money. The town is, oh, nicely protected, actually. Hmm. I'll try. And we will need some help, looks like it. So start the combat. Yeah, that's not good. We need some one stacks. We do need some one stacks, unfortunately. Because these guys will not come out, right? Wait for it. And then... I don't know. Try over there. Okay. And there. Nice. And once more, perfect, but we don't survive another one like that unless I cure you. Yeah, that might uh, do the trick. Okay. Come on, guys, we can't lose this. How much? 112, okay. And you kill this guy and you kill this guy, right? And why do they go after them suddenly? That is 
Something I cannot understand. <laughs> they almost won and then they gave up. Wow. Okay. That's not bad. A lookout tower or a wall of knowledge? What do you think? Oh, we have a capital for free, by the way. Thank you very much. <laughs> and, um, hmm. I have 16. Yeah, let's do a lookout tower. All right. There's uh, some giants, some other stuff around, a shipwreck survivor, Fafner, but there's a mountain range right here that we cannot go through. There's more, probably a gold mine over there. How are we going to continue, by the way? Do I need to take uh, the ship? I guess I need to take the ship. But uh, now we do need help from others. You bring um, a little bit of uh, money, right? So we will hire you. Oh, and you bring even more money. So that's fine. Let's go down here, there, there, over there and out. And as I said, you bring also a lot of money. So we'll take you too. You can go for this and for that. Uh, you can take your goblins and get rid of them. You can take these goblins as well and build an ogre fort over here, Archer's Tower, because we won't be able to build the capital here, of course. And this guy can continue his quest. Null Marauders. Sure. Can we get another level, by the way, or not? 165, 167. We can, actually. So we'll, uh, we'll get it soon. Can't go there just yet. No more money. Goblins, though. Hello. Uh, do I do the Cyclops Cave? It costs a lot of these things, and I want a Behemoth Lair more. Why can I not build a Behemoth Lair? Because of uh, money, right? So... You can be here. Oh. What's happened here? Camped by the side of the road, as if waiting for you, is a group of rugged mercenaries. Their leader approaches with a cocky grin on his dirty face. The wizard kings paid us to ambush you, but we've been talking. We'd rather wait and see who wins this war before we take sides. Move along in peace. <laughs> the mercenaries step aside. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Now I have 10,000, which allows me to build a behemoth lair. That's what we wanted to do. Ladies and gentlemen, that's what we wanted to do. Sir Mulik, uh, you'll just have one guy like this and go there. Uh, you can, of course, stay over here. That's giving us resources. Uh, flag some stuff there, go after the mighty Gorgons, don't let yourself be killed, of course. Quite a few as well. Let's uh, blind at least a few of them and try killing three first and then kill two and then go away. Kill the three, kill the two. And that's it, right? Excellent. Oh, look at that. Isn't that sweet? The Pendant of Courage. Oh, yeah. So this is done. We can take you 
and have you carry this stuff around. Uh, we just have that. Actually, I can give it to I can give it to her as well or to anybody who goes to my main town maybe. Not so sure about it. We'll see. So you can go pick up some junk, go there, you go there. And we start building up more towns. Altar of Wishes is something I probably want. Um, no more money. So next turn. You stay here. You stay there. You stay over there. So you have something to do. And I think there's nothing else for me to do than um, go and board the ship unless I want to go for the zealots and uh, and the Griffin Conservatory, which I don't, to be absolutely honest with you. So let's go for the ogres. Nice. And buy a ship. And you can't board it just yet, but uh, these upgraded guys, that would be something, right? That would be something. So 4,000, 2,000, 1,000, but we cannot build anything there, so that's fine. Um, only the Cyclops cave is missing. It's day six. We don't have 20 crystal and we won't have it probably either. So, resource silo, oh, that's uh, rather expensive. I want a portal of glory, so barracks, I guess. And I probably want the cloud temple as well, so golden pavilion, but for that I'll need more uh, stuff. Right, so let's do a wall of knowledge maybe instead. Any other heroes that we might want to be interested in? Oh, this guy comes with uh, ballista. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting indeed. And we don't need a mess hall. We don't need anything, actually. At least 50 of your soldiers have come up to you over the past few months to tell you they've had a child and named it after you. Apparently, back in the wastelands, the same is true. Having your people honoring you in this way makes all the pain fade for a moment, but more importantly, it pleases you to know that everyone believes you're on the right path as well. I wasn't so sure about that. The ocean lies before you, but remember that the wizard kings have dominated the seas as well as the land, and may attack you at any moment, so watch your back. Yeah, I can't build a cloud temple, unfortunately, because I was not prepared to pay for the golden pavilion the other day. My mistake, but okay. Stables is definitely something I could think of uh, doing. Monastery is something I could think of doing. Do I have a res uh, this thing? Yes, I do. So let's exchange a few uh, things like some gems and build a monastery. Okay, so we can't build the angels this week either. I should have probably concentrated on one of those. Now I don't have any. But oh well. Money, and now I can board the ship and then go either here or here. I don't know where that goes, but I can also go there. It shouldn't be all too crazy. I think mess hall, mage guild, let's do a mess hall. Okay, last chance to hire a hero with the ballista. Hmm. Yeah, let's put him inside here. He might just provide the ballista. Ballista itself is worth two and a half thousand, so he's basically for free. And specialty navigation hero, interesting. Don't know, not yet. Next turn. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. So first go here. Perched on top of Guano's plot spire of stone, jutting from the water, is what appears to be the head of a statue. Just when you're beginning to wonder how it got there, and perhaps how you can retrieve it, a flock of angry griffins swoop down from their cliffside nests. I do not want to retreat. That's uh, quite a few. We can deal with 25 over there, maybe. And there's 25. Okay. And now we can go. Only 22 damage. That's a little bit more damage, but I think we are fine now. Go into the corner. And uh, hit these guys. Thank you. Hit the 8. Don't destroy my ballista, please. Okay, and now try over there. That should be more than easy. See? Easy. And another level and a head of legion. Okay. I think we are missing one piece. So, fifth level units, sixth level units, third, second. So, we are missing fourth level units, which will be probably a chest piece or something. Legs, loins, arms, yeah, chest piece is probably missing, and then the head. All right, go this way, and we continue. We build a cloud temple, of course. I don't know which uh, town do I want to build up, whether I want to build up uh, this capital over here with... Uh, Giants, or whether I want to build up the Portal of Glory and uh, and Angels. Hard to say, really. Okay, you can get that, you this, you over there. And I don't think we need to do all that much more. Getting all those goblins might be a nice pastime for you, Sir Mulek, but... Hmm. Ryan with a healing tent and this guy. I don't know, doesn't appeal to me too much. Next turn. So who was that there? Who was that? Now I have 15 birds, which is pretty good, if you ask me. Probably should do something with them. I have also behemoths, unupgraded ones, but we'll see. Do we go this way, though? That's the question. I think we can at least try. I will accept the help of the stone golems, because they might help me with the giants, believe it or not. They will make me slower, but uh, I'm willing to accept it. Let's do also all the resource silos, now that we have a lot of money. And, uh, okay, we see that they are taking uh, the water way as well. You think there are any titans in there? I don't think so, but uh, can't be sure. Let's test it out. It seems like there aren't, okay. So how do we do this? We need to protect the ballista the most, basically. So. Hmm. Like this. Let's haste everybody. 
Oh, are we on a? Oh, we are on a good, uh, good terrain. Wow, I did not realize that. So that means we can also slow them down, which will be even better. Can, oops, no, I did. What? A, a giant did not kill a, a stone golem. Wow, that's crazy. You can also kill one, believe it or not. So, well, or just not. But let's slow them down. And that's going to make everything so much easier. <laughs> I can stay there. Oh. Still. Kill two. Yeah, he survived with one HP. Little bugger. Okay, much better. Go back. And uh, one stay there. Okay, it didn't help too much. Um, stay here. Defend. Defend. Kill one again was not possible. Fine, kill the two. Defend, defend, defend. Kill that. Actually, I wanted to stay there, but fine. Nice. Love it. What's on the other side? Ooh. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. Look at that. There's a blue town. And there's a green tent. White tent. Uh, upgrade -y thingy. And a vial and another town, of course. And there's a... There's an Armageddon's Blade over there. <laughs> Just like that. And another hero. Okay. Well, look at that. We have some... Some fighting to do. Do we want to return here? Or not? Hmm. So I do not have a um, summon boat. This should be easy. I said easy. You understand easy? Uh, well, maybe not particularly easy, but hopefully easy enough. Okay. So let's... Uh, Blind the quick guys. Go after them and defend. Let's blind the... Uh, the shooters. after them again. Okay. That's 32. That's quite a lot. Let's go away. All right. Move here. I can... Blind them again if I wanted to, but I do not. This might be a problem. Okay, one, two, and three over there. Wait for it. Okay, this guy will be a problem. How much do you have? 200, okay. That's enough to kill this guy, I believe, or at least try. Okay. 
no biggie. Defend. Kill the 16. Kill the 2. Kill most. Start with the shooters as well. Probably shouldn't have gone there. Yeah, that was not the best idea in the world. Guess I will have to defend, shoot there, and then go away for a moment. Come here. Defend, defend. And now wait, wait. Start here. I'll probably slow them down just in case. I want to keep these guys. Hopefully. Nice. Very good, very good. No problemo. Let's go this way and see where that leads us. Okay, so Cloud Temple done. The other things done as well. So now here, Portal of Glory needs a lot of resources. Mostly the Mercury. Let's do this resource silo as well. And the turn. And there's a there's a town there, right? They showed it to us. Yeah, there's a town down here, protected by nothing. So I'll keep the the guys over there and take the town. Or actually I can take some units here, so let's Let's keep what we have. I don't need to actually fight them all that much. Uh, yeah, let's keep the one stacks. Okay, that's actually pretty good. So what do we take? Uh, three of them, two of them or, or whatever. I, I take two of these guys, right? They must be enough. Day four, I hopefully... Oh, hello there. That's a torso. That's exactly what we need. That's exactly what we need. Nice. We have been here. Need to go after the stables as well. And after the... Nothing else. <laughs> Next turn. Yeah, they weren't kidding that uh, getting an advantage early on will help a lot. Pack of Naga Queens might be rather problematic, but I'll try to survive nevertheless. Uh, 74, I can make one go away. Kill the two over there, block here, and then you can kill one. And one more, and two more. Okay, defend, 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 and we do this guy. That guy. This guy. Go away. And that's it. Only lost one. Perfect. Do we have now the 
statue of legion yes we do so what does it do 50 percent generation in all towns yeah no in all towns based off of the castle creature generation level wait a moment is it really in all towns all creature production increased by 50 percent in all towns based off of the castle creature generation level it does not include flag creatures or other no okay so if i look at for example over here i will have statue plus one okay very nice and over here nothing yet but over here statue plus one nice i like it i like it good job okay then we still need to continue down there's a mana replenishing thingy over here which is great we can take that day six what is the easiest way to get there i think i may need to get rid of these guys because day six i will get somewhere over here and then day seven i may not have enough I may not have enough. So you think there's anybody there? Tarnum is quick, almost 2000, but without the roads. Yeah, look, he can get basically there in one turn. So basically where? There in one turn. And probably there in the second. Okay, we'll, uh, we'll have to measure it. It might just be five, three. Hmm. It might be beneficial if I disband them now. It just might. Okay, how are we doing on time? Still very good. So I'm not in a rush. Here uh, we need one. Like that, Portal of Glory before I forget. And we get one extra from the Statue of Legion. Perfect. That's what we are looking for. And that's it. Uh, maybe the upgraded uh, altar of uh, these guys. Don't need the slow ones. Okay. Next turn. And I do go for the mana because I wanna. And then we go through here. Pack of Cyclopes though. That's rather a lot. Still, we'll have to do that. You don't believe your eyes, but then this magical land has been filled with many wonders that don't seem real. But there, but there, by the side of the trail, is a tree ripe with fruit. Fruit that turns out to be precious gems. You quickly order some of your troops to pick the tree clean, aware that not all of the gems are making it into your coffer, but who cares? interesting okay please do not kill my guys thank you and can i get there yes i can yes i can get there perfect that's what we wanted to see uh mage guild no and cyclops cave unfortunately also not but we do have angels giants and the other guys as well so I think we are pretty good. Oh. Who are you supposed to be? You have the dream again. The dream. That's what you call it now. Always the same. Always everyone you know is bloodied, torn and dead. And you know it was your hand that killed them. But it's just a dream, isn't it? You never would have heard Yala, nor your parents, nor, well, killing your sister was a mistake. If the wizards hadn't stolen her from your home, it never would have happened, right? 
And Harduck, well, you had to kill him and the other captains. You regret it, but Harduck's death was for the good of your people. Harduck and the others didn't understand that the Wizard Kings had to be completely destroyed like an injured limb that has to become infected, that has become infected, must be chopped off to save the body. Uh, you can say whatever you want, uh, doesn't make it any more true. Do we need to save? Probably not, yeah, we can just go. Really? Start the combat, please. Okay, and uh, then... A lightning right there. And wait. See? That's just fine, isn't it? Defend. Don't kill that, of course. Wait for it, wait for it. Can we bless? Nice. Okay, so the town is ours on day seven. There's a red Keymaster's tent right there. Interesting. We will have all these troops and the Legion gives us more. We can even upgrade potentially. I will upgrade the Altar of Wishes though. Uh, I can also upgrade the Wall of Knowledge for now. A hero? Not really. Okay, how do I get uh, my hands on the Armageddon's Blade? Guess I have to somehow get here into the water, probably through the whirlpool. In any case, there is a curl who will not be a problem, I think. So, pretty good, I have to say. We can go and do this anytime we want. There's a monolith two-way there, which we need to do. But it's all right. Okay, day seven. I guess we just build whatever we can still build if necessary. Uh, probably training grounds we can do as well, who knows. And upgraded temple, not really. Yeah, both towns, nice. And this one. I like it, I like it. Let's uh, stay in the town. Replenish mana, see where our opponent will go. He just picks up the stuff and goes down. Okay, so we can go and fight him. But I guess that's something for the next episode. For now, let's pick up some ore, some gems, some money. And can you go and kill him? Yes, you can. So 50 to 99, a lot of these. Some, some, some and some. Should not be a problem. Should not be a problem with this army. But um, we'll do that in the next... Uh, Actually, look at that. I can get my hands on like three titans. Well, not three of them. Actually, yeah, I can get my hands on three titans. Look. Two. And... Three. Speed 11, speed 9, yeah. I think this will do. <laughs> this will do just nicely. Some cannon fodder, maybe some master gremlins, like how many? Five. Don't need more than that. And then we can go and attack. Sure, but we'll do that. Uh, some other day. For now, I thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.